All right, good morning. Happy New Year. It is the second, so I hope you guys are already making progress on your goals. I want to talk today about how to get motivated to crush it in 2019. As you hop on, let me know where you're tuning in from. If you're watching this live, drop me an L in the comments, or if you're watching this on the replay, drop me an L. So good to see you guys hopping on. Just out of the gym, and it was uh, it's cold and rainy here in Dallas. And uh, you know, it's funny. I thought being the beginning of the year, typically the gym gets super filled up. You know, the first uh, part of the month, my uh, uh, old father-in-law was. Uh, talking yesterday, he was a director of the YMCA and he was saying that, uh, you know, the gyms and the Ys and all that, they make all their money in January with all the new subscriptions. And he said by, you know, March, the gym is dead. And that's what I notice. I mean, I've been in the gym consistently for years now. And typically, you know, in January, everyone's motivated. Gym starts filling up, hard to get equipment. And then another month or two, then it's easy to get the equipment. But here's what's interesting is today, the gym was dead. And, uh, you know, it's cold and rainy here. So I guess despite people's New Year's resolutions and all that, they decided they would let the rain stop them. So listen, if you're watching me, chances are that's not you, right? But we sometimes tend to, you know, let things stop us. And uh, I did a call this morning and uh, listened in, had one of my good buddies, Jefferson, was talking about the same thing, cold and rainy, the gym was dead, and he reminded me of something that I wanted to share with you guys this message, this morning. And it's pretty simple. We don't, we don't feel our way into an action, we act our way into a feeling. And I gotta think about all the, all the years, how that's been amazingly true for me. I remember getting into network marketing and getting into sales and having to obviously make uh, calls. What's up, Eric, good to see you, man. Estonia in the house. Hey, Apple, good to see you. Hopping on. So, um, you know, in the beginning, it was hard to make calls. It was, man, the fear of the phone, the fear of rejection. And I would try and get motivated so I could make the calls. And I realized I would never get motivated. And so I never ended up making calls. And then once I kind of started acting on this thing, if you act your way into a feeling, uh, I would force myself to make a few calls and you get more motivated by the action. And so I think that's an amazing lesson for all of us. Hopefully you've got your goals and your action plan and all that set out for the year. If not, guys, get busy. Uh, your, your 2019 is gonna be based on the intention that you set at the beginning of the year. And I'm telling you, I am setting an amazing intention to absolutely crush it in 2019 like I never have before. So uh, how do you get motivated? Number one, you gotta have your goals in front of you. The act of setting goals goals motivates you to take more action. It's why, you know, over the last 50 years in network marketing, kind of the standard procedure when someone gets in, the uplines are all talking about set goals. What's your why? Set your goals and then go take action. Why do we have people set goals? Because the act of goal setting gets you more motivated. How else do you get motivated? Well, you act yourself into the motivation. You know, if you force yourself to get into the gym, you feel more motivated to work out and you feel more motivated to work out consistently. And so that's the message of the day. It's a quick one. It's if you act your way into a feeling, you don't feel your way into an action. If you wait to feel your way into an action, oftentimes you never take the action. You get comfortable, you get complacent, and you just sit there in life. And you know, the old saying is super true. If you're green, you're growing. If you're ripe, you're rotten. You gotta be green and growing, always moving forward, always taking action, even if it's just one step forward. It's like today. Man, and was my workout today gonna turn me into this ripped bodybuilder looking guy? No, not, not at all. I won't see the action for today's workout for probably 90 days. There's a delay. You don't notice anything for a while. And it's like that in business. It's like that with your health. It's like that with uh, your nutrition and your diet and everything else. And so there's a delayed reaction, but you've got to act your way into the feeling. Do that consistently and just have that as a reminder. If you need to put a note on your phone, if you need to write that as a note and see it every day, act your way into a feeling. If you don't feel like doing it, will yourself to do it and you'll feel more like doing it the next time. So listen, appreciate you guys tuning in. Got to be quick today. Got a lot going on for the day. If you feel like this can add some value to some others, definitely share it. Love to hear your comments as always. Thanks for tuning in. Let's go make life an adventure.